Here we go. All right. I'm going to let y'all funnel in and uh, make sure we don't have any technical errors happening. You know, this is uh, definitely like uh, high tech going on here today. We got a uh, cell phone camera and a computer. Let y'all trickle in. <laughs> What's up? How's it going over there? Is it on? It's on Facebook? Hey, Jeff, what's happening? Am I on Facebook? All right, good. Good. All right, so, uh, yeah, today... I'm doing a solo live performance with no band, right? It's called the Leave Me Alone performance. <laughs> All right. It's right from the chest up, right, to cover the COVID pounds, guys. All right. So, look, I got some tunes I'm going to do and just some jams. I'm going to try not to use any backing tracks. I got a drone queued up that I'm going to use. And I might use one backing track if I just start feeling like rotten about myself, which could totally happen at any point. I want to thank everybody out there for supporting us and helping us through the surgery. Here's an update. See, there's the little tiny scar where they took out a tumor. Yeah, my record label called me today for the first time in probably like a year. And they said, uh, hey, didn't something happen with your eye? <laughs> I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. I had a big giant tumor removed behind my eye. And uh, then, uh, yeah, that was it. So, hey, good to see you guys. Um, yeah, I'm kind of limited, like, in the songs that I can do. So you guys might put out some requests and – you know, not everything translates well to solo harmonica. Well, yeah. It does look like it's not sharing on your personal page. It's oh. coming up on the fan page. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, should I start it over, you think? Or just share oh, it from the fan page? If you could share it on your own page. All right. All right. Here, this is exactly why we're starting early. Let's <laughs> see if I can, if I can share it. Uh you can't, all right, let's see. Uh, <laughs> um, I think we're stuck on the fan page. All right, I'll, I'll figure something out. All right, all right. All right, sorry guys. Uh, it won't share to the fan page, huh? All right. It, it will, it just isn't to your personal page. My personal page? That's what I'm figuring. Uh. All right, almost time to start. I still got one minute left. We're just going to do the best we can. If you want me to, should I just stop it and start it again? You think on Facebook? Sorry, YouTube. All right, everything's going great on YouTube. <laughs> All right. Hey, guys, today I'm using Blue Moon harmonicas from my man, Tom Halchek. I'm using my signature Jason Ritchie microphone. I'm going through a bunch of lone wolf pedals into my harp gear amplifier, and I'm going to be playing some acoustic stuff. All right. We're going to start off with just a little shuffle in E. Are you ready? Shake off the dust. One, two, a one, two, three. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
put like a little thing to let people know that to go to the fan page if they yeah. if they can't <clears throat> all right you guys thanks for bearing with me i'm still shaking off some surgery rust but i'm here for you what's up pg mal my student all y'all sorry if i don't holler your name scott everybody gustavo what's happening y'all all right here's a little one off my last album it's already gone uh, triple aluminum in Bogota, Colombia. It's called My Chops Were Rolling. It was reviewed positively six times in the whole world and negatively once. All right. So that's good odds. All right. This one's called Don't Badger the Witness. <laughs> One more. Don't you badger the witness? Well, don't you badger the witness, man? 
Is a point and blame? I'm just narrating the game. Don't badge the witness, man. They say I'm up, but I'm feeling down. Call me lost, you all know I'm found. Yeah, it don't matter what they say, they won't believe you anyway. Just trying to stick around. Let me blow. <laughs> Miss Yeah, thank y'all. What's up? Clayton James, what's happening, baby? Joshua Bowden. These are my YouTubers. I can't see you, Facebookers. I hope you I, I got the, the camera turned around the other way. All right. Let's keep going. All right. So uh stay in the key of E. I'm playing in second position on a Honer Marine Band. Blue Moon Harmonica, y'all. Appreciate it. Oh, if you've seen this video now, share it. Share it on Facebook. Let people know I'm doing stuff. And if you can, tip within your budget. 
right? I don't want to cost some young child somewhere like uh, a little llama stuffed animal or something, right? So if you need to buy a Christmas present for a little kid, especially a llama, you know, the money is better to go there. But if you got the extra dough and you can help me out, I appreciate it too because I'll probably use the money to buy some little kid a llama. All right. This one's called, uh, <clears throat> this is an R.L. Burnside song, and I kind of stole the riff from Howl and Wolf, and I'm going to mix it up. <clears throat> it's a little thing called Jumper on the Line. So uh, with uh, this R.L. song, so I'll tell you the story behind the tune. So I was like uh, 21, and I was living with uh, David Malone Kimbrough, Jr.'s oldest son, Robert Kimbrough, if you're watching, shout out. Um, and they had moved. David had met me in Memphis. I was playing on the street. <clears throat> Dwayne Burnside, Gary Burnside, Kenny Kimbrough all came walking down the street and saw me and offered me a job playing with them, uh, with David. So I moved into David's house in Potts Camp, Mississippi. This is back around 1995. And uh, the very first night we went to a club called Seuss. And I was pretty nervous about going in there because when we got there, someone had just gotten stabbed in the parking lot. <clears throat> so we got into the club and I set my amplifier down. At the time it was a Fender basement. And I set my amplifier down and I sat on it <clears throat> so nobody would be confused about why I was there. And R.L. Burnside, David announced to me that R.L. was going to come play and I was going to play with him. So it was just RL and me and uh, RL sat right next to me. I had never met him before. I had heard his music on vinyl, an old French recording, all acoustic. And uh, RL sang this song, <clears throat> Jump Around the Line. <clears throat> I didn't know what the words meant, but I do today. All right, so we hope you dig it. Jump Around the Line. <laughs> Fix my supper, babe. 
same child let me go to bed. Fix my supper, woman. Let me go to bed. This white lightning child done gone to my weary head. See my trouble, Lord, hang out on the line. See my trouble, Lord, hang out on the line. No matter that goes, something on my weary mind. mellow baby let's get mellow <clears throat> so uh i hope you guys are okay i'm okay i'm good i've been doing really good man i appreciate y'all thank you for tuning in to my stripped down show this is only the uh second time that i've ever like publicly performed without a band without a guitar you know you know so uh, it's it's kind of I was I was nervous I was like really nervous like I started getting nervous like on Saturday right <laughs> and I almost didn't do it but you know uh, that's what we do man we go forward right you know there's only thing to be afraid of is fear itself right that's it man so let's let's uh, talk on that subject for just a second so. There's a lot of things in the world going on, and I'm not going to offer any opinions on any of it. But I, uh, I wrote this. Somebody wants to see the shoes. They're, they're not good shoes, man. Gary Hodgson, they're not good. I can't even get them up that far, man. I'm too fat. Anyway, the point is there's a lot of stuff I can't control. That's why I wrote this one here called It Starts With Me. Oh, my God. 
you guys. Appreciate it. it starts with me. All right. Hope you guys are uh, staying safe out there, doing your best to keep your heads up. I know for me, like, one of the hardest parts about this whole thing, you know, aside from, like, not being able to play music and travel and talk to all you guys is, like, you know, you get stuck in the house and you get anxiety from not being around other people and not seeing other people. And then when you have to go out of the house, you get anxiety from having to go out of the house because <laughs> you're so used to not seeing other people. You know what I mean? <laughs> man, it's crazy, man. It's crazy stuff. All right. <clears throat> I'm going to do a little train tune right now. Little train. Uh, do the best I can. All right. You know, um, this is one I did, um, uh, pretty much it's going to be all improv, right? Like I, I, I might know a couple of things that I'm going to do, but I'm mostly just going to make it up. And I made it up on a record, uh, one time with JJ Appleton, the great JJ Appleton singer songwriter out of New York city. And, uh, it's just on that record, it's called Jason Solo, so you can find it. I'm using an A-flat harmonica. <laughs> Seems to be working. All right, no air. Oh, wait, is that an air leak? All right, that'll work, that'll work. <laughs> All right, we'll do it. All right, love y'all. Love you, Pete G. Love you, Mal. Love my boys, all y'all. Appreciate it, man. Thank you, guys. Check out my videos on YouTube. I've been back for a minute. I put out uh, a few videos this week. Thanks, guys. Healing up good. Really no pain. Nothing that aspirin couldn't handle. The doctors did a great job. Anyway, a little solo harmonica thing. <laughs>
That made words in Scrapple. Hope y'all still watching Facebook. I hope the phone's still running. Choo choo, chaboogie. All right, let's keep going. All right, <clears throat> check it out. <laughs> All right. Yeah, man, like, look, check this shit. I put up one video in my life, right, in 12 years of me playing guitar, and some guy got mad, and he wrote, like, remember when Jason used to play harmonica? And <laughs> it's like, man, come on. Anyway, look, you're right, man. I'm not, I'm not a guitar ace, okay? But it's not about the guitar, right? It's about the song. Here's an old R.L. Burnside song, another one. This is my favorite of all the R.L. tunes, right? It's a little thing called Going Down South. The first time I heard this, it was played for me on guitar by an Alabama Onian by the name of Bart Pate. He recorded Johnny Shines. He had Mad Cat on, his re on that record. Um, had a little studio in Memphis, Tennessee. And uh, we were getting high together one day. And he pulled out the guitar. He looked me dead in the eyes. And he sang this tune here. Uh, I remember a couple of times R.L. playing it and uh, looking me dead in the eyes right during the part where it says I'd rather be dead and smiling ear to ear. It was spooky. Anyway, here we go. <clears throat> Going down south. That's a little better. Going down south, I'm going down south, going down south, I'm going down south, going down south, I'm going down south, chilly wind don't blow.
get the Jace Ritchie signature mic back out through the Lone Wolf pedal supply. All right. Hey, man, thank you all for, for coming in. I appreciate you guys. I appreciate you a lot. Thank you. I know the live stream thing is getting old, man. I know it, you know, and that's why I'm trying not to do like a lot of them, you know. I've only done a few, and I appreciate you coming to this one. All right. Mm, I do not have the best pitch of anybody in the world. But anyway, it doesn't matter because I'm too strong for pitch. Well, I'm too strong for you. Well, I'm too strong for you. Way off the amateur grid, and baby, I don't play with kids, honey. I'm too strong for you. What kind of cake you like? What kind of cake you like? Well, I'm going to beg you right till the morning meets tonight. Tell me what kind of cake you like. Honey, I'm too strong for you. Let me blow.
Till the morning meets the night, tell me what kind of cake you like. for you <laughs> that was a last minute addition there <laughs> thank you all baby thank you all thank you all. appreciate it all right let's see what else we got here wow i moved through a lot of tunes man i moved through a lot of tunes all right <clears throat> let's see <clears throat> what's up mal thank you baby <laughs> love. Oh man, nothing like hearing Big Walter do that one. Anyway, love y'all, man. Appreciate you guys. I'm not done yet. I'm still ready to rock. All right. Let's see what we got here. Thank <laughs> you. 
My clothes all ragged and my shoes all worn. I feel so good, I'm gonna blow my horn. Well, I feel so good today. It used to take a lot of dope, made me feel this way. Well, ain't no why ain't got no girl. But I'm the happiest man in the whole damn world. I ain't got no wheels, I ain't got no girl. I'm gonna try that one again. Ain't got no girl, ain't got no world. slipped away. Crown and pleading won't do me no good. Gotta come back, baby, I wish you would. Early in the morning about the break of day. Well, that's when my baby slipped away. Thank <laughs> you. 
bad baby. <laughs> Just making it up as I go along, baby. There we go, right? All right. Let's pull out this one. A little more guitar. This is uh, one off my first album. And actually, uh, Kenny Kimbrough played drums on it. Eric Deaton from Afro Sippy. Uh, and Junior Kimbrough and R.L. Burnside and Sidel Davis. Uh, Eric and I used to be close friends. We're still friends. We don't talk as much as we should. Anyway, I learned how to play guitar like this from watching Junior. Uh, I can't do it like him, but I do my own version. And this is a song I wrote called Soul Desire. Just 
guitar action baby that's it man all right man let's see what else we got all right i got one speaking of eric deaton this one goes out to you baby this is a song he wrote called from the soul uh it's off my uh feel good funk album with eric deaton on guitar slim lewis on bass and randy blitz on the drums uh this is one eric wrote and uh, boy, it sounds good with drums and guitar. But here it is, just the harmonica called From the Soul. He changed the title of it a little while back. I don't know what he's calling it now. I did record it like a new jacked up version of it with Nick Moss. And it's on YouTube. So if you just type in From the Soul, Jason Ritchie, you'll get both the recordings of the original and, uh, and uh, the one with Nick Moss. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Jason Ritchie here. I appreciate you. I'm going to go out on a little Petty Music Studios. Thank you so much. Appreciate you guys. I'll see you next time. Take it easy, y'all.
sound there man petty music jam you can jam along yourself you know putting it in the comment section of youtube thank you facebook appreciate y'all thanks for tuning in thanks for the tips thanks for sharing it everywhere we'll see you next time jason richie here ending the stream good night y'all bye